Boom. Yeah, it's me. Right here. Um, and as you can tell, yes, that is the line that I am doing. However, if you've watched any of my previous... Let me just readjust this. I've got to get all my lady friends in here. Um, token vaping. If you have watched my previous video, I have already done a review on this line. However, since the game is changing for vaping as a whole, um, the main person behind this company and her husband have decided to change with it and have updated their line. So this is more of an update review than it is an actual review review. However, regardless, amazing woman. Um, she, she's just all about vaping. She's all about... Uh, the fight up for advocacy and vaping rights as a whole. Her company is a huge supporter and part of uh, SFAFTA, um, which is one of the big, biggest uh, vaping advocacy groups. So real quick, if you have not joined in any way, shape or form, if you've not made any type of a donation, if you've not contributed your name to any type of uh, helpful um, support for advocacy as a whole, please do so. It is never too late. Um, now more than ever, we need to combine as one and basically fight as one voice to uh, let the government know basically that we as vapors, we are wanting to fight for our rights to be able to vape and to be able to vape freely. So if you have not, please do so. Um, with that, as you can tell, it is Dumb Blonde Juice and you can purchase the hat. You can get this really cool shirt, which yes, I am wearing it backwards. Do not make fun of me. It is not by accident. It was on purpose because I wanted to show the really cool logo on the backside to this. This is the shirt, Dump Blonde Juice, um, which you can purchase the shirt itself. Uh, it's a men's shirt. Um, obviously, you can also get a men's long sleeve shirt. You can get a woman's shirt. And they also have really cool hoodies, which I will probably be looking into getting myself, um, especially with the cold weather starting to hit and they are not only really comfortable but they are really warm so this is the front and if you have seen this logo they are quite active on the media um, between Dumblon Juice and their team Team Dumblon um, definitely check them out on Facebook Instagram uh, Google Plus Twitter I mean they're all over the place so definitely um, give them a look give them a follow give them a try um, also check them out at their main website which has also been updated it is uh, dumblonjuice.com um, everything on there is listed all their juices um, the the various uh, four, uh, four nicotine levels that are offered the 0 3 6 and 12 um, they are, do, are offered in a 15 mil and a 30 mil and the prices are on their website and it is a 70-30 mix. However, it has been updated. They have reformulated their their uh, flavors and the formula behind the flavors, which they do use an ISO Clean Lab. So it is, um, this company takes their juices very, very seriously. And it is one of the main reasons why I'm a huge fan and a huge supporter of them. Um, everything they do with this line, they, they follow every compliance regulation, every rule. They even updated for the new FDA regulations, whether they have wanted to or not, but they are very compliant and they abide by every ruling that is out there. So just amazing, amazing, amazing people. Uh, not just the ones running it, but the people that work for them, the people that, that are on their team, um, just all around, just a great group of people and huge, huge uh, vaping supporters and fighters. So definitely, definitely give them a check out, please. Um, their ingredients are all USP certified. Um, you know, they, they use good manufacturing pra practices all the way through GMP. Um, like I said, they just, they're they, they leave no step skipped. They leave no stone unturned. They leave no corners. They don't cut any corners. Everything they do, they throw all of themselves into this. Um, but I just want to go through and like I said, this is more of an update review than it really is a breakdown review. The flavor profiles have not changed. The main thing that has changed besides um, the logo, which I'll show you here in a minute, and the main thing that has changed is the formula that they've made the flavors in. They are much, much smoother. They are much more flavorful. They are much more enjoyable. The line originally was very solid if you've watched my previous video. Um, however, like I said, they reformulated it. They tweaked a couple of things here and there, and they changed it. Um, and as far as comparing the flavors to the originals, you always raise that question, how do you make a good thing better? Very, very often than not, it usually doesn't work to where it's better. It's just different. 
this is one of the few examples where something that was very good became better in a good way but it's also cooler because you weren't aware that you could have improved it um, this way if that makes sense um, like I said it was a very solid line to begin with so when they t when they let me know that they were reformulating their formula and they're coming out with a new recipe and a new uh, a new setup I was I was curious about it because you know it at first it didn't seem like they really needed to now I see what they're talking about when they say that you know they definitely are very proud and and accomplished with what they produced because now this line just went from really good to amazing um, I did leave one sealed um, for this video and it is my flavor of choice from this line so the reason why I left it was because I really enjoyed the original version of this so I'm really curious to see how much more improved um, the flavor is but if you do not remember or if you've not seen it this is their original line this is a spare bottle that I happen to have and honestly I just I thought I'd already uh, used this up but this is my flavor of choice um, dumb luck it is uh, vine ripened strawberries with originally it was put as a sweet sugary uh, surprise um, but it's a fresh baked sugar cookie um, with strawberries added this version was just amazing by itself it just had a fresh baked cookie goodness with strawberry uh, added to that so I'm really looking forward to doing this first vape but this was their original bottle it was the clear bottle it had the child safety cap um, and it had their logo as you can see on here now you ready for this dun 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 bam that's the new bottle these things are freaking beautiful um, they've gone to a blue tinted bottle um, the colored glass also helps contain flavor and the juice better so that it holds longer um, it doesn't uh, it doesn't allow as much light in so it doesn't get uh, overly steeped or the the nicotine doesn't get affected as quickly they've gone to color coordinated blue dropper bottles and they are sealed like I said this is the one that I saved for the first vape first impression and you can see from the from the glare on here there is a safety seal that is also required by regulations as of now um, or as of the 8th I apologize but they are they were all sealed but this logo the foil label that they use the quality of this thing this is beautiful it is amazing the the girl herself the pinup style girl that part stayed the same with the wings on it but that's about it everything else has been updated everything else has just been made to look so much cooler it's so much more eye popping but it's not gaudy or tacky so they were definitely smart with the way that they did this but it is an amazing amazing label um, comes through with the nicotine as well here it has and I apologize for the glare I'm gonna see if I can tone this down a little bit just so it's not so bright up in everybody's face um, it comes up with the the bottle size here the nicotine the name of the flavor right there okay now that that was my computer that did the backup well oh, that's pop sorry about that that's actually where the glare is coming from um, you have all your uh, ingredients over here the product uh, the uh, website here the warning labels barcode and then all the needed warning labels and California um, 65 warning that's necessary on everything like that so just a big 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 improvement over that yeah I don't like how dark that's become so I'm gonna go ahead and do that I do apologize um, but just a huge improvement over an, an already well done bottle um, but just with the foil with the thing it almost gives it like an older um, a warm metallic look so it definitely fits that much better Whew, sorry I don't mean to get all excited but like I said I've been a big fan of this line from when I first heard about them breaking and um, as you can tell actually uh, MND Vapors, uh, Nessadani and Burnsy Girl are part of their team as well and I'm a huge fan supporter of them as well and I've gotten to know them pretty well so just overall like I said once you once you contact this company once you look into them a little bit once you test out the juices I mean you will see how amazing a company this is and in no way shape or form I'm trying to overhype this and I know that's kinda how this is sounding and I really don't mean it to but again like the juice review itself this is strictly my opinion this is just based on stuff that I know this is interactions that I've had with these people um, 
it's just it's it's I'm proud to be part of a, such a wide diverse vaping community that incorporates um, and encompasses people like this. You know, they are they are about the the advocacy aspect of this. They are about the rights of this. They are about um, promoting uh, healthy products, good products, um, uh, well made products. Sorry, I didn't really mean to say healthy. I'm not really sure why I said that. Um, but overall, just an amazing group of people that are all the way around, you know, and this is just a truly, truly great company. So there is five flavors in the line. And like I said, the main thing that they did was just go and update um, the flavors and the profile of them. They didn't change the flavors specifically. So out of the five, you're going to have So Confused, which is a sweet and creamy blend of uh, a blueberry vanilla ice cream with a waffle cone very very smooth um the blueberry ice cream aspect of it are just amazing it's just very solid definitely get the blueberry definitely get the creaminess of the ice cream the only thing that i was kind of lacking in it and it's not on the company i've come across this a lot when i do um when I've done other flavors that are supposed to have this type of uh, flavor with it. The waffle cone is not an easy flavor to um, emulate and make strong enough in a flavor as far as when you're doing an ice cream. You do get a little bit of an almost pastry type hit to it, or at least I did, um, which would be the waffle cone aspect. But if you focus more on the blueberry ice cream uh, flavor, it's still it's still a very smooth very enjoyable uh, vape in itself as that so it definitely is still worth it um, clueless is a cinnamon roll stuffed in a double glazed donut now when I first first tried this flavor I was kind of skeptical because I'm not a huge cinnamon person I don't eat many cinnamon rolls as it is and then finding out that you know it's supposed to be in a double glazed donut I figured it was going to be overly sweet or it just come off really really um, saturated in like a sugary type uh, glazed uh, flavor if you will not the case um i won't say i've ever specifically had a cinnamon roll, cinnamon roll stuffed in a donut to say that i know exactly what that tastes like but you definitely get um you definitely get the cinnamon um the cinnamon roll flavor part of it but normally in a lot of flavors that use cinnamon the cinnamon is very very strong now they it does feel a bit strong in this flavor but it gets compensated very well actually for the pastry aspect of the cinnamon roll but with the double glazed donut you get the extra sweetness with the pastry of the donut aspect which combines with that cinnamon so where most people would look at it and think that it's going to be really really rich or really really uh, sweet it all actually smooths each other out so that you don't get too much of one over another but you get enough of everything to make it a very um, a very hearty V. So if you do like cinnamon rolls, if you do like pastry, I mean, it's definitely, definitely one you'll you'll want to add to your rotation. Uh, Dumb Luck is the one that I'm going to go ahead and do for the first vape. Um, the one called Huh H U H um, basically is just sour fruit candies. Now I wasn't. That was probably the one I liked the least out of the first line, just because I'm not a huge candy person, and for me it was a bit strong. Not so with the case with this one. Now. Like I said, with them smoothing everything out, it definitely has lightened the, the hit of the of the sour candy to where it's fruitier. So it's much more enjoyable. It's a much more smoother candy flavor. It still has a sour hit to it. It's just not an overly slam in your face, um, you know, empty an entire bag in your mouth and call it good. So definite, definite improvement, but much, much better this time around um, more fun is a butterscotch candy uh, with a slight bit of brown sugar drizzled in uh, drizzled with car caramel again I'm not a candy fan but this is something that you definitely will want to vape if you like sweet if you're looking for a more uh, solid dessert type flavor um, the sweetness of it the the hit of the brown sugar which almost comes off like a mapley uh, aspect to it with the creaminess of the butterscotch it is for anybody that likes sweets this is definitely going to be a solid hitter for you I, I can almost promise that you're going to like it um, but that is the case with all of that and on top of it 
not a single throat hit in any of them. 70-30 mixes are kind of iffy from one thing that I've learned is that depending on how the flavor is made or depending on the type of flavor, it determines a lot of what the throat hit is going to be like. Does not matter, not a single throat hit on any of these. All solidly smooth, all solidly enjoyable, all very, very well improved to the point of where now instead of trying to pick one or two flavors, you now might be considering having the entire line in your collection instead of just, you know, one or two. Um, definitely, definitely awesome. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and do uh, the first vape as well, um, just because now I'm starting to feel like I'm speeding up in my talking and rambling. And if that is the case and that's how I'm coming off, I'm very, very sorry. Um, I'm just really looking forward to this. So I want to get this done. Ha! Huh. It also, I'm, I'm really, really warm right now because in my place it is really, really hot. So getting all heated it just makes me want to speed through so i can turn the fan back on so again i do apologize to you guys but thank you for putting up with this i appreciate and am honored by each and every one of you that are watching so i'm going to go ahead and bust open the dumb luck and do this vape um, with my cotton as you can tell it is clean it is white so i can make sure i get all the flavor out of it the only cotton that i use since day one that i've tried it is texas stuff cotton it is not a thin pansy as cotton ball it is very durable holds flavor very well lasts a bit longer than most cotton that i've that i've used just a really solid wicking cotton that i enjoy very much so if you're interested on instagram it's texas tough cotton now i'm gonna go ahead and bust this open and dumb luck was the fresh baked sugar cookie with the vine ripened strawberries so i'm really 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 looking forward to this one because i was a really big fan of the previous one Oh, before I forget, also, if you go to their website and make a purchase currently, um, as of right now, um, there is a special going on with uh, Dumblon Juice and the company called Vape Sling. If, you've not know, if you do not know of or heard of Vape Sling, then you really don't follow Instagram or social media a whole lot. They are another company that is huge in vaping rights and advocacy um, great people running that company as well I've been trying to get one of their vape slings for a long time now I've just um, circumstances and timing has just never been there for me but if you go to dumb blonde juice right now and order three bottles three 30 mil bottles from them it comes with a special a, a limited edition designer vape sling um, zipster uh, version from them there's three color choices to, to uh, choose from, and they have the, uh, the DB on them for Dumb Blonde. So it's just a special edition one um, that was done for this to help uh, promote both and help support vaping advocacy as a whole. So very awesome companies in collaboration. Great, great reason for it. Great juice that you're getting, and it's a great product. Honestly, I may end up ordering three myself just to get the vape sling. But... With that said, um, this is dumb luck. I'm gonna go ahead and get this going. <sighs> strawberries, and they actually smell like real strawberries, not like a strawberry candy or a fake strawberry. So I definitely, and you can see, it is not very colored. It's pretty clear. Um, and it vapes really clean as far as the, the juices themselves. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and juice this up really fast. I don't wanna take up way too much time for you guys. Um, while I'm juicing this, um, I also just do want to uh, reiterate real fast, anytime you order something, regardless of what it is, regardless of where it comes from, but anytime you order something or purchase something and there's supposed to be some form of a safety cover on it, whether it's a cap, a twisty, a child safety cap, a wrap, a uh, taped locked, uh, um, like the tightener tape, um, clear wrap, whatever, if there's anything on it that is supposed to be some form of a safety security measure and you just do not feel comfortable with it for whatever reason when you get it, just don't use it. Contact the store, contact the manufacturer, contact whoever you need to to make sure that you can get the proper product in the proper form it was supposed to be so that you feel comfortable with it and safe because at the end of the day, it's all about your health and safety, period. With that, Dumb luck, as always, vaping at 75 watts. You can see right there. Um, fresh baked sugar cookies with ripened strawberries in the new uh, updated version for their uh, juice.
that is smooth, and I thought I was a fan of the first version of this. Honestly, this is amazing. It almost is gives you a fancier taste to it so that instead of it being a sugar cookie with strawberries in it, it almost tastes like it's a fresh baked sugar cookie with stra uh, strawberries on top and you eat it almost like a little dessert cake instead of an actual cookie. That is awesome. That is truly, truly amazing. I, I, like I said, I thought I was a fan of the first version. Now vaping this, it, it's like a whole new take on this great great flavor very smooth no throat hit and you saw the clouds solid so dumb blonde juice continuously lisa and everybody else associated with you and this company amazing 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 new line revamped reworked revised version two however you want to word it this is awesome thank you so much for this privilege this is a great opportunity and this review was entirely a huge huge pleasure on my part um guys like i said definitely check them out dumblondjuice.com instagram facebook google plus twitter any form of social media i'm pretty sure they're attached to so definitely give them a give them a check out give them a follow give them a sample give them a try definitely if you like their first line you definitely want to try this line if you have not tried them yet this is definitely the time to jump on and try them. This new line is amazing. Um, as always, I'm Token Vaping here on YouTube. Definitely hit that little red button down there for me if you'd be so inclined. But thank you for watching regardless. Um, Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, Pinterest, anything that I can do to help enhance your vaping experience and make it better. That's the only reason why I'm doing this. Um, anytime that I can help another vapor in any way shape or form that's joy for me so in closing I just want to reiterate thank you guys so very much for watching and if you like I said about the advocacy if you've not had a chance to join definitely put your voice with everybody else's and be heard as one um, and don't forget about the three 30 mil bottles with the limited edition vape sling at dumblondjuice.com till next time guys thank you so very much for watching vape on vape strong and have a good night